Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Just Outside the Workshop. So I just got done going to one of my steel suppliers uh, down in Dayton and I just picked up a whole trailer load of steel, some quite long lengths of 2 inch round 1045 for making some hammers. Uh, I also got a long length of about, I want to say it's inch and a half I believe it is, it's inch and a half H13 stock for making some different uh, power hammer tooling for an upcoming build that I'm doing. And also there's a big chunk down there, I don't know if you guys see that or not, uh, but basically that's for my 30 pound sledgehammer job. Um, it's a four inch, four and a half inch diameter, excuse me, uh, round 1045 stock for doing that. But I just wanted to take a real quick moment to take and talk about the dangers of buying stuff online. Now, you'll have to excuse me because this is gonna be some shaky footage. I need to get myself a gimbal, but hey, there we are. Let me walk inside the shop here real quick so I can sit down with you and talk for a second here. Woo! All right, there we are. So I'll try to set you guys down here. Sorry, should add this better plan for this video, but just kind of a little improv thing. So basically what I wanted to talk about um, is the fact that I nearly paid double for what I had here just by ordering it online. Now, my wife is a very smart woman and uh, she's not as pig-headed as me. And she decided that it would be better uh, if we called in and so she called in instead of the looking at the online prices it was like man that's gonna be a lot of money uh, by the way it was over eight hundred dollars basically it was well over eight hundred dollars I think it was eight hundred eighty six dollars for that out there online went to the steel supplier went ahead and got to the steel supplier or went ahead and called them up and it was half that price it was half get that right again half that price or nearly so it was like 456 instead so not everything that you can buy online is a good deal be a man don't be like me go and inquire call them up sometimes companies will give you a much better deal than their stated prices sometimes online uh, you know you have to as a company you have to pad uh, pad the price a little bit if you will based upon you don't know where this person's out of what type of shipping you're gonna have to where they're located at uh, if they had to take and put that on a truck are they driving 45 minutes away or they're driving six hours away and so therefore they have to pad the prices for those reasons but there again as uh, I'm only I want to say I'm 15 20 minutes from Dayton so it's worth the call, it was worth the drive down to go pick it up versus having it delivered and everything else for nearly double the cost. So buyer beware online, not always is online a great deal for you. Also, just wanted to say, check out the new merch. We can't all be the flavor of the day. Uh, you can find that over at our uh, website at ChristCenteredIronworks.com. You can go there or you can go to BlacksmithPDFs.com. Links are in the description down below. And that'll go over to our merchandise store, click on that, and it'll head you over to Teespring, and they can do all the fulfillment there. So, it all goes to help the channel. Thank you all for being here. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave it a like. Remember to comment what you thought, and uh, hit that subscribe button if that's something you're into. Without further ado, I'm going to get back to smithing. God bless you all, and we'll catch you on the next one.